Hello, 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 How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to Map Play Slashers Keep. Ah! Couple days we've missed. Um, uh, I'm gonna give you the same excuse I, I give every so often. Um, uh, headaches, man. Uh, I'm, I'm sure a good, uh, uh, also, by the way, hello. Hi, I'm Malf. Welcome back to Slash Keep. Uh, dungeon floor four of 45. Um, I probably, you know what? Let's put one that we're more likely to use. Um, yeah, I get, I get sinus congestion headaches, um, that are, um, driven by the weather and it's like normally I look forward to here's the thing autumn is my favorite season I mean I like them all for various reasons winter I actually like as well I like fluffy snow and uh, you know building snow forts and and all that kind of stuff um, is a big part of my childhood um, but yeah I mean autumn I love I mean you know trees are beautiful it's sweater weather which is by far the best weather I think because you know it's like it's not too like you could wear a sweater or a jacket and you're not sweating you know I, it, it, whereas in the summer I mean sometimes you're just like you know you like it because it's, it's warm but sometimes it's just too warm you're like I can't take any more clothes off you know Cause then I'd be naked and even that it's like maybe it's too hot or it's too humid to do anything about um don't want that gem not really um but yeah like autumn is is generally fine but it's like that transitionary period between summer and winter and the, the that's like you know it's 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 the not the momentum that kills it's the inertia or whatever it's kind of what I feel like autumn is sometimes but anyways it's been a really mild winter last winter I remember being really mild and I feel like it's kind of been that case for the past few winters but uh, it's like January and it's it's back and forth it's teetering. It'll be snowing and then and then it'll turn to rain in the same day and the snow again. It's like those constant fluctuations mess with my my sinus is something fierce and uh, you know I know there's other people out there probably in the in the the comments that have the same feeling and uh, or the same experiences. It sucks because like with these kind of headaches too, they don't just. It's not like you just take a ton on you're like, all right, whatever, I'm fine. One, because like, I don't want to take pills, and I very rarely do, or like... Oh, two, two, two bronze keys. Um, improved lunge as well. Okay, well, that doesn't help us unless we're... Three bronze keys! What the heck? Uh... What was I doing? We should also put bombs on there. That'll be five. There you go. Um, we got a lot of strength. Wait, what happened to our wand damage? What? Am I... Losing my mind? Didn't it used to be like 6,000? I know we've been changing stuff a lot. Maybe, I, yeah, I don't know. It's fine. I know I talked about, uh, you know, it recently, but whatever, no worries. Um, yeah, like I, you know, one, I don't like to take tunnel because it doesn't really work, right? You're just trying to stop the pain, but really what you should be doing is trying to stop the root cause. It's just a bummer because... I don't want that. 
the root cause isn't something like, well, you're not drinking enough water or, um, yeah, let's just get rid of that. These, nah, nah, nah. The green, the small greens, I'll keep. Oh, not three bronze. It was two bronze and, and the, the silver key. Uh, what was I saying? We got a button as well. There you go. Yeah, like there's some root causes you're like, you can you can change, right? Maybe if it's like I had a headache because I was dehydrated. Okay, well, the the reaction isn't to take time out, it's to drink more water, you know? I guess maybe what I could do is just move to a different climate, but I like Canada. Although to be fair, I could also be in like a better health, a better condition. I can actually like, do any exercise. <laughs> it, it wouldn't hurt, I don't think. But, uh, yeah. Anyways. It's, uh, it's just poopy when you have a headache for a couple days, right? Sometimes you're like, well, okay, it's one day. It's not fun. I don't like it. But we'll get back up on the pony tomorrow. And, uh, and we'll, we'll, you know, it's okay. We could play catch up. But then it's like you wake up the next day and you're like, oh, the headache is still here. It sucks. Ow. Is this another? Yeah, I'm like not, I'm full on autopilot in this game. It's a good thing that we are relatively strong. So I'm probably going to make some mistakes. Okay, we want... Damien, you know we, we want a pog potion. One per episode. Thank you very much. And maybe some more red rarity items. Legendaries, call them what you will. I want them. Even if I don't end up using it, having a red that we can put on the altar is always exciting because you get so much back in return. Should be it. Wait, we got one more bronze. Wait, didn't I use one of these? I don't know. Anyways, I feel uh, I feel good now, which is is nice. I. Like, even this morning, I was kind of feeling a bit eh. But I played a new game. I'm, I'm sure uh, this was on stream. I'm sure some of you maybe were there. It's called AI Dungeon. Well, AI Dungeon 2. But technically, you, like, play it through a website. Um. Okay, <sighs> I got to focus on what is... Oh, red! I was just talking about right the golden eagle. Oh my gosh. Spreading unity, justice, and liberty one swing at a time. Wow. Damage 12, 32 to 21, 36. Speed medium. Uh the 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 you see the arrow? up above beside liberty one and time i think the red arrow means it's do it's doing less damage and then the green arrow is saying it does it's more speed which makes sense dexterity plus 40. i see swings rolling strike so this is one we're gonna take for free um i'm not gonna use it it looks awesome though that's the first time i've, we, I've seen that art for a weapon this is a unique weapon, right? It's the Golden Eagle. So it's always going to be called the Golden Eagle. It's always going to look that way. But I learned... What was the one we got much earlier on? Like the Exterminator or something? Like it always looks the same. And it's pretty awesome. But it has... Uh, the stats are still different. So I think that's... I'm going to assume kind of the same the next time we see... The Golden Eagle, it's not going to be the exact same skills and stats and all that kind of stuff. Um, but also, let's look at 1830. 
1894. So these aren't doing any more damage than what's on our dude. That one has 33 strength though. And then this ring is a first. It's a frog. Infernal Band of the Exalted Noble. Plus 13 intelligence. It's got a lot of skills. Uh, artisan as well. You got a blue helmet. Okay. Well, we'll buy that. We're gonna we're gonna put this on an altar, which means we may have to hold on to it for a while. Let me look at our ring. Nine strength, ten dexterity. It's got master smith, which I do like. Hello. But we have a lot of strength and dexterity. Don't have a ton of intelligence. We'd lose Master Smith, but we gain another level of artisan, which should mean we get another gem or component we can put on our. Oh, actually, we're maxed out at level ten right now. Okay, so. Um, I'm gonna hold on the ring. Actually, we could buy it and sack it. How much? It costs two thousand. We have twenty thousand. Let's buy it because it doesn't take up a ton of space. We're already holding on to this. Um, inventory management, like the further we've gone, is become a bit less of an issue just because like, we're getting so strong and we're so rich with Golden Tongue that like holding on to and selling everything is really is not necessary. I mean, we could do it if we really wanted to min max and stuff, and I'm sure we'd be more powerful because of it, but you know. If we're able to, to one-hit most stuff, then, you know, then I'm not going to worry about min-maxing. You can make a case that we already have. Uh, again, it's, you know, we'll hold on to it because it's, it's a one slot and it's a blue and that could get us something more exciting on an altar. Um, okay, those things we don't want. These gloves... I will hold on to some greens, but again, that's probably going to be limited to more things like amulets and rings. So we can sack those. Uh, did we do... I'm still curious about the keys. You know? I think we've done everything, though, so let's go. Uh, yeah, anyways, we're playing AI Dungeon. And it's really freaking wacky and cool and so i started out today like i was a little uh you know coming off of a couple days of having a headache you know you still feel a bleh the game is so funny that i laughed and laughed and laughed and laughed and i just you know it made me feel really good i haven't laughed that much that hard in a long time Not 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 trying to pimp too hard, but you know, check out the Twitch Twitch TV slash Michael A L Fox. I, I'd like to play more of it, but it's also the kind of game you don't want to play too much, um, too quickly, or it, it just becomes like the you know it's just not it's like too much of a good thing, right? I always say, you know. Like, as a kid, you're like, oh, man, I, I wish we could have Christmas every day. But then you get older and you start thinking about it. And you're like, that's actually terrible. That would suck because it just wouldn't be special. What gets you excited about it is that it happens but once a year. And, and, um, and because of that, that's, that's, well, that's, yeah, what makes it so cool, so. Some games, they're really awesome, but if you were to play it every day, you'd get tired of it. And then you might even start to dislike it. And I don't want that. It's like you, you listen to too much of a song or something. After a while, you might be like, yeah, I just don't ever want to hear that song ever again. So sometimes, as difficult as it is, you gotta be like, yeah, let's... Let's just stop listening to this song for a bit. We can come back, that's okay, but let's not ruin it forever. 
feel like it's gonna be hard to be a, mu a musician because of that though, right? Like, imagine if you're the freaking Rolling Stones and you're still out there, like, you know, I don't know, Iron Maiden or insert any other band that's been just playing. I mean, you know, they come out with new songs, of course, and, and new albums, but a lot of bands, and I'm sure there are exceptions to this, but a lot of their earlier work tends to be the stuff that people want to hear, right? Which means you're playing it for decades and decades and decades. Like the Rolling Stones, they're still playing Gimme Shelter and stuff like that, right? Which is a great song. But I imagine they're kind of like, all right, you could... Let's play something else, maybe. But, you know? Hey. I guess if they didn't actually love it, they probably... They wouldn't do it because they're so rich. They don't have to keep playing music. So what do I know? What do I know? Alright. We're kicking butt. We'll eat some salami. Admire the posters. Uh, especially this one. Uh, yeah, sure, let's go this way. Wait, what's my current quest? The acid. Well, I mean... We know we can do that on the boss fight, right? But it's gonna be a while, because we're 45 dungeons, so we're probably gonna wait until... Like, floor 20 or something before we actually fight... Spider Mama? No. No. Ah. Ah. Man, our weapon is super colorful. It's wild. That's got golden tongue. I gotta pay attention to these uh, component drops a bit more because they are slowly getting better. Not better than what we've already got, I'd say. But at a certain point, they will be. Hmm. See that? It's not bad. Deflect as well. Oh, it doesn't do strength or intelligence or, or dexterity at all. So that kind of, I don't want to say it invalidates it, but it kind of does. So like that shaft at least got plus six dexterity. I'm finding like the chests too are underwhelming. A lot more the further we go. That's okay. Okay. Uh, so we can go... Just making sure we did everything on that side. We can go in here. I hear a dude bopping around. We want the blue, glue, the blue goo drop. Okay, hold on. That looked kind of impressive for a sword. Eat, eat him. Look at, like, every dude I get, I'm getting a freaking component. This is wild. Okay, sweet looking at Divine Axe Head of Order. I don't remember how much our Axe Head does on its, or our, uh, what do you call it? Our Crystal Mace Head does. I mean, the weapon itself, after we craft, it does 3510 to 4382. But I think it did over two... Th yes, that's right. It did over 2,000 damage before we crafted. So this guy is not going to replace it. But it's purple. I'm going to hold on to it for now. Oh, that sword is not as good as I thought. It's got a lot of spells, but... We'll drop it. It's taking up too much space. Okay. okay. Get the pot. Mmm, potion. Not a pog potion, but... It is still a potion. Oh, crafting. I 
Screw it. Eh. Um. <sighs> Twelve extra. I honestly cannot remember if the last time we crafted, if we were at level ten, because of the the the, the couple days off from playing. So. I'm not gonna worry about crafting it. Like, we don't even really have uh, this, Chris. I don't. I'm just gonna drop that. It's not any better than what we've already got. Um, hold on. There we go. Uh. Yeah, like if we get a better crystal or whatever we can, or a better axe head or whatever the case may be, then we can we can revisit. But even if I'm going in there quick, it's still gonna take me freaking five minutes to to get it going. And yeah, so it's all good. It's all good. Again, trying to be a little bit quicker. How I play the game and not not being quick for the sake of being quick ne necessarily but just like I think I should be quicker at this point because we're so strong you know what I'm saying okay there is one room back towards there uh, or back towards the center I gotta watch where I'm going to. I don't want to take. How do I? Oh, we go through the secret. Oh, I see. Ah, let's go. Alrighty, let's um. So we're actually gonna do the red one first because. I feel like somebody had mentioned this in the past, but like when we sacrifice a red item, it seems to like elevate the other stuff. I don't know if that's that's true or not, but I'm down with it. So let's let's get the the big the big head honcho out of the way first. The golden eagle has been nice knowing you, even though it's been a short time. All right, let's um. Let's see what we got here. These are green boots. Again, for green, they're pretty good, but not good enough. Let's move these over a little. So, armor 330, range crit, melee crit is up. What are our boots? Oh, 30 dexterity and 30 strength. Yeah, no, 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 no. Listen, I, I, these, these are good boots for sure. There's nothing wrong with them, but they're not as good. Uh, don't forget we want to sack these things. Just put this stuff down here. Mm. Lightning infused Sikra of Elegance. No, okay. I will check. Uh, actually, let's pick all this stuff up. Get it out of the way. That's a blue boy. Queen's Mace of the Floating Fortress. Ah. Oh, wait. Actually, these gloves. Armor 220, Dexterity 19, Strength 20. So, same Dexterity, but we get an additional 20 Strength, which more damage, more max life. Uh, armor's 220 versus 212. So, I mean, even that is a is a is an upgrade. How about skills? Um, so we're not losing any Master Smith. We're gaining some lifesteal with the new gloves. We're not losing any Artisan or Disassemble. Yeah, neither have those kind of skills. So this is just a, a legit upgrade. So 20 strength. Let's see. We've got how much... 3756 health. Let's just say 3750 and 17 
300 damage. 30, 3750. So we increase our damage by 500. We increase our equipment level by one. And what's it? 3750? 38. And we increase our max HP by 100. Not bad. Not bad. That's all because of the plus 20 strength. Okay. I'm going to save the greens for last because I want to I wanna see... I want to spend more time seeing if they actually do uh, increase our chances of getting a elixir or enchantment. Okay, hold on, what was this? Is that a... That's a component. Plus four strength, plus four dexterity. Alright, well hold on to that one. It's got the lifesteal. Fiery blows 19 to 39 damage. Ugh, why is that so low for a purple at this point? Still the strength and dexterity is nice and the lifesteal is good. I'll take a mind blast. What the heck is... Come on, let's move this over. Mischievous Shirt of Reverence. 487 armor, plus 33 dexterity. Fiery Blows, 259 to 491. Master Smith 2. Deflect 3. It's got Artisan as well. Heavy Blow, you know, it's got some good stuff. 459 strength, 31. So this, uh, we'd, we'd swap strength for, for dex, pretty much. We would get two levels of Master Smith, though. We'd lose a level of Scrap Collector. I could swallow that. It's the strength, really, but I mean, our strength is 527. Dexterity. We did just gain, we just gained 20 strength from the gloves. So, really, think about it. We're losing 11 strength. Instead of 31, but we're gaining 33 dexterity. And the, the two levels of Master Smith, I like that a lot. What is it at right now? 12. So we do crafted weapons deal 20.6% more damage. So 20.6 to 21.2. So that's point. Was it 20.6? Yeah. So 0.6% more damage for two levels. And you're kind of thinking like, ah, that's not a lot, but like, honestly, though, it, it is. <laughs> it is when our weapon <clears throat> is doing so much damage. And this is 11 out of 10, which doesn't give us any more components right now. But I think... Um, <clears throat> Like, how Artisan used to have a hard cap of 5 levels in earlier dungeons. Now it's 10. So, I think as we go on, I, I don't know when or what, but it probably will go up to 15, I'm going to assume, at some point. And, and maybe it goes up beyond that, but... Let's, um... Let's just keep on keeping on. Okay. Whoa. No, it's not not as good as I thought. It's okay. Let's get this going. Blues. Do I want this hilt? No. We're, we're saving the greens for last. Generally. Okay. These are shoulders. Before we get rid of them, good icy swings. Two levels of master smith. Level of artisan. Two levels of deflect. Five twenty six. Thirty seven strength. Max HP. Icy swings up. Eight hundred damage. Yeah. Goodbye. All right. No elixirs yet. That's okay. Crystal. That one's not good. It's knockback. I don't care about knockback. It's gloves. Strength and dexterity is down. Oh yeah, that's right. These ones are these ones are better. Okay. Let's get rid of them. 
Okay. Okay. Okay, we're almost done. And I'm not doing any backtracking to get other items to put on here. To be honest, the the red one. Well, what did we get? We I think we got the gloves out of the, the sacrifice and the armor. Yeah, actually, you know, this has been good. Getting replacing two items. Is pretty good because the, our existing equipment was already quite solid. Okay, there's some more axes. Just get that blue guy out of the way. Ha! Uh, you got a wand. There's a sword. Yeah, all these guys are lackluster. We should be getting down to potions pretty soon potions and rings no drink no ring no N no N no oh baby we got a uh, we got a uh, Plus 36 strength. Oh, yes, sir. So we did lose a little strength from swapping the armor. But we made it back and then some. So let's... 17,000 17, damage and uh, life is 37. 38,84. And then pretty much 18,000 damage. Not too bad. Not too shabby. Okay, there's a wand. Just check it. Lightning magic, but much less damage. That's piercing magic. Which doesn't need to do as much damage because it pierces. You know, it goes by their armor, so. And there we go. Okie dokie. Time to go. Not a bad altar though. Increase their strength. We got some 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 added dexterity. I'm a happy camper. So yeah, I mean we did get the the pog potion. From a, a green item, I believe. So we'll keep we'll keep an eye on that. We'll keep testing that on future altars. Oops, he's a mouth. He's already dead. He dropped the key. Yes. Okay. I mean, yeah. A lot of these components are dropping our trash, but it's just... It's, actually, it's just like nearly every enemy. It's like over a half of them. Real man's legs of the star and the suns. Shouldn't it be the sun and the stars? It's only one sun. Well, the universe is pretty big. I'm sure there's another civilization out there that calls their star the sun. Or maybe not. I, 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 no, no, stop with the freezing, dude. Quit harshing my vibe. Um, I'll probably just get rid of some of these bronze keys. I, it, they seem to drop more than I actually need to use half the time. We didn't use either of those. See, now that's a thing. Plus eight strength, plus four intelligence. Although, again, the actual, like, fiery blows on it actually blows. Not in a good way. Okay, there's the shoot. Man, I haven't used that in 
basically when we're about to fight the boss at this point. Because there's no fear that I'm going to die at any point and I'll need to, to go back to power up. We are power. We are Groot. Ooh. 312 armor plus 25 strength. So that's 22 strength. All right. So I don't feel guilty about swapping it. You know, sometimes you'd be like, oh, this is this is 30 strength, but we the one we've already got is 30 dexterity. I don't want to lose that dexterity. This is just a, a very simple upgrade. 312 armor versus four, or 228. Two levels of Master Smith and two levels of Artisan, though. That's Master Disassembler, though. I think our Artisan is still at uh, 11, right? Okay, so Master Smith goes down. Not ideal, but you know what? It's okay. I'm still going to swap it. It looks bad. It, it it works with our armor better too, right? It, it, same color. What is that? It's like a dirty bronze or something. You know, a lot of some people are like, oh yeah, I'm I got I'm into blondes. Oh, I'm into redheads. This that. Oh no, I only like dirty blonde. Me, I only like dirty bronze. No, specifically guys named Bron. That are just actually dirty. They haven't showered for a week. Got a real thick layer of grime and just a stench about them. That's my that's my thing. Don't kink shame me. Oh, another purple. Okay. I think it does more damage. Then our mace head on its own. Amazing hunk of knighthood. I'll probably just have it just in case. We can, we can, we can actually, we'll check the crafting on the next floor. Let's look at the shaft. This game makes me feel dirty. Um, the boots. The wand. Yeah, let's, I mean, that's free anyways. We'll take it. And just, you know, we could hold on to sacrifice it, but let's just, uh, let's just sell that bad boy. Please come again. Please come again. I'm that guy's only customer, I feel like. Sometimes I don't need, like, I don't even want to buy this stuff. I'm just like, ah. He's going to go out of business if I don't support him. I can't have that. Um, yeah, let's do this room. It looks like it's isolated. Get it out of the way. I have found a secret. Odd. Uh, How, sir? Yeah, I don't. I shouldn't heal after that. Uh, it's not a great secret. I guess the passageway is the secret. Um, what was I gonna say? Yeah, I mean, look at my, our, our our life steal on that guy. We that's eighteen hundred. Because I feel like traditionally in a lot of games, lifesteal is based on like a percentage of the HP of what you're hitting, right? Maybe I could be wrong on that. I could be wrong on that, but I feel like that's more traditionally how it is. But ours is just like a percentage. It's not. Um, It's based on how much damage we do. Right, like, oh my God, melee life steal. Yeah, like we're stealing the life from them, but it's like they don't have that much life. Huh? 
You know what I'm saying? <gasps> the chances, uh, those big boxes, they're the best chance at elixirs and enchantments from my experiences. But, you know, we've been getting a few on the altars, which is nice, and I'm going to pursue that by sacking more and more green rarity items. But I, I'm telling you, I enter a room, I see one of these. I get more excited seeing this tall health chest than this, or crate, than this, this item chest. No lies. Drink that. Okay, there's a gem. These things we don't care about. All right, hold the door. Get rid of you, get rid of you. Plus five intelligence, life steal, starburst, fiery blows. We'll, we'll hold on to that for now, but I don't think it's better than what we got. We, we really need like a big boost to, to gems. Um, nothing has, has rocked my world in the past while, sadly. That's okay. It's a... They've been gradual improvements. And also just the fact that it's like all of the gems we are getting are pretty much at a decent level. So they don't seem as special because we're just getting that quality so consistently. Nothing really stands out. Okay, we're cruising. We're cruising. We're cruising, baby. I feel I like I don't know how this episode has like been 42 minutes though. I feel like I've been faster than this. I don't know, man. Oh, I just walked right into it. Oh, we are almost a level though, which will allow us to perma learn. This guy's gonna drop a lot of items. You're firing backwards, but I like it. You you did also hit your friend. I can't hit myself because he's so slow. I'm just holding this for the altar. It's small enough. We can hold on to it. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. What's next? I think that's the floor. Where's the exit? Oh, is that little crevice we, we went by, but we didn't go down? Okay. Hold on, let's go. Skirt. Skirt. Get in there, friendo. All right. Should be crafting on this one. We we will do a, a quick crafting session to take apart our thing and see if the new hammerhead uh, indeed does more base damage. Nothing there. Pog. Dude, I hit the front guy and it, like, the force of him hitting the other dude just straight up murdered him. Let me up, let me up, let me up. Let me at him. Pots, 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 pots. Oh, <gasps> enchantment. Plus 22 intelligence. I'll take it. I'll take it. 
So we'll put that on uh, our our gem for crafting. I'm gonna perma learn. Yeah, let's do this. Care about that? Okay. Yo, three tall ones. Come on, come on. Give me one elixir at least. Let's go. It's dexterity, baby. Oh, I also forgot to give myself. Uh, yeah, we'll do some intelligence because we just got thirty-seven more dex. What the freaking freak, dex? You're my freaking brother. I love you. That's Deborah from the show Dexter, the one about the serial killer who kills other serial killers I, yeah I'm just gonna drop those they're getting in the way um Deborah <laughs> oh no 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 Uh oh, these guys are dropping acid. Wait a minute. Watch this. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, because we got to kill an enemy with acid. It was like, dude, I'll just push this guy into it. But uh, it, it, it goes away. I don't. And now they're not going to be able to drop acid much. Let's just get rid of them. Yeah, we could have tried to cheese it, but it, it probably would have taken too long because the skulls tend to have a just a path of their own, a league of their own. Great movie. many freaking crystals you guys got in here Ow. got him potions potions poster That's, oh, no, that's not crafting. We should, I mean, I could use the, uh, the maps. I know we got a lot of them, but I'm kind of like, even when we use them, whatever. It doesn't mean we can get to the crafting any quicker. You know what I'm saying? Because we don't know where the hallways go. Owie, ow, whoa! Plus 38 dexterity. We just increased our dexterity in the past like three minutes, two minutes uh, by, uh, let me see if I can do the math, uh, by 75, 38 plus 37, right? Dang. Some might say that's impressive. I mean, let's just do it now, right? Look at that. 543. That's good, man. You know? Just gotta make sure we, we're, we're not getting one hit by anything. Stay ahead of the curve. I don't know where we shut this bad boy off. There's our crafting. Um, you know what? Let's come back to it because we might happen to find another crystal, crystal, or a shaft, or, or some type of component that we want to use, so.
I am not afraid to do uh, a little more exploration before we get to it. Nope. Um, this is where we go. Oh, that was the Spectre Blade. I was like, what was that little blue blade? I don't really pay attention to that all that often. Okay, there's your exit. No! Outrunners. This is a lot. What the heck? Wait, where'd they go? I didn't kill them. How do they die? I'm so powerful, man. I don't even know my own strength anymore. Alright. We're actually pretty much done. Come on! I zapped him. Don't care about that. We'll keep those for now. Shrewd Gata? I thought it said Gouda for a second, and then like, oh, dude. I love Gouda. It's true, I do. I mean, I do. This is great cheese. Especially smoked Gouda. I don't know what it is about that smoked Gouda, but it lends itself pretty well to smoking. Okay. Ah. Uh, Okay, um, let's just, uh, yeah, that's the only thing I don't like about, I mean, those we're not using, this is just, it takes, like, so much time. Okay, take you off. Disassemble, oh my goodness, so let's check, this is the old one, 1879 to 2346. 2061 to 2673. So we're increasing the damage by 300 and change on the max level. That's the base. And remember, we're applying now we're applying a whole bunch of percentages on top of everything. Uh let's do our enchantment before I forget. So this no, it's this one. 68 dexterity. Oh, we have no intelligence on that. That's that's kind of wild. So 16 items. Honestly, can't remember how many we had on the last one. Uh, well, let's just count here. So we had basically. Mm, I don't think this guy. Oh, we had one, two, three, six, nine, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So I do think we get to have one more item. Wait, actually, maybe we did have this one. I can't remember. Yeah, I think we did have that one. Maybe. But this is where we're going to swap. Oh, the thing is, so this technically has more strength, but we also get more strength by using crit or gems. Mm. That's not a gem though. So it's plus three things. So if we swap it with like, because we also have two Jewel of the E, so really it's like plus six percent damage for each one. So even though this doesn't have strength on it, it still makes more sense than this one 
Okay, I think that's a glitch. That's okay. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, plus the shaft is nine. Um, let's put the head on there now. So these guys, uh oh, no, 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 I didn't grab you. You want to do it like that. Just hide them. I mean, we could even just leave them where they are, but. <sighs> okay. So we get six more. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, basically we're not using this this guy anymore. Okay, that's fine. Put you in there. Yeah, whatever, just stay there. And then we'll put you there. And you there. Yeah, that can go there, that looks fine. And then these two guys. Mm. Oops. Rotate. I was going to layer them behind. Just keep it like that. It almost looks like another hammerhead thingy. That's 16. What are we calling this thing? What are you? What's your astral smashing part? about to fall apart oh wait I put the wrong one on I believe okay I'm glad I caught that Like, I wish there was some kind of little icon when you hovered it over here. It's like, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Let's double check. So this is the one I want. Okay, yes. Sorry about that. Okay, that should be good. Uh, What are we calling it again? Amazing hunk of knighthood. We'll just call it a hunk of the east. We've got two of the east. Hunk of the east. Plus I live... I'm in the, the EST time zone. Alright. So yeah, we'll get, rid of, we'll get rid of all that stuff after. So our base damage right now before we put it in our hands... 39.56 to 51.30. Wow. Does it do more now that it's in my hands? No. But it's amazing. Our overall damage, 19,897. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Did our health go down? Ah, oh, this had max HP of 69. Six. This might have some max HP, but certainly it doesn't have as much. Max HP of 70. Okay, it's fine. Though, defensively, we've never been stronger. It's so much dexterity. Alright, let's, uh figure out how the heck I get out of here again. 
We get one more florin. I have no idea how this has been an hour long. Not a complaint, just... I have no idea. Alrighty, let's see how this weapon do. Again, it's not gonna. I don't. We're we're already so strong that we're hitting everything in one shot anyway, so not really gonna notice a difference. Hey, something's pushing the box. Oh, it's the blue man. We still haven't found blue goop. It's so rare. Please drop the blue goo so we can put it in that special apparatus with the green goo. That's all I want. Nice try, punk. I'd love to kill him with the, the acid, but at this point, I'm just going to wait until we get the spider mom. Ah, oh, more dexterity. I'm not going to recraft the weapon just to apply it. I mean, maybe at, maybe at some point, but I'm not going to do it in like the next level, probably just because I want to upgrade more than, than one thing if we're going to spend five minutes rearranging everything. Although I guess if we're just not changing any of the other components, it'd be super quick to do, but... I need two more dexterity. So in this episode, we've increased our dexterity. If I were to apply this in enchantment, we just got by 95. Well, actually more than that because this armor, but still just purely from elixirs and enchantments. That's impressive. A few episodes back, it was like, that. We got like three pog potions for strength that increase our health by or our, our strength by 100. Whoa. That's a pretty sweet amulet. Ah, uh, gloves. I will take this just to sack it. It's purple. Honestly, same with the sword. Don't get yourself killed. Yeah, because I've been noticing. I don't know. Altars seem more common to me now. I, I don't know if we might get to the point where like I don't really want to be just uh skimming through levels to the point where we actually don't explore the whole thing you know it's like as soon as we find the exit we just go but we we might be able to do that a little bit ah. it might come back to hurt us a little bit you know we won't be leveling quite as much and we won't be finding as many elixirs and enchantments and all that stuff which do make the big difference I think but you know who knows maybe here and there we might be like oh we've we've explored 75% of the floor and the exits right here now you know we, we might have a couple floors like that, especially once we get into the... Where's the shutoff? Yeah, once we get going on the 70 floor dungeon, we... We, we may skip a couple classes. All, oh, I was going to say all these crates, but not a tall one. Okay. Alright, look at all these pots. There's got to be an elixir in here. Nope. Um, 
money is just floating above the fire. Hot metal. Ow. See, I mean, these guys, when you actually let them hit you, they do damage. And I do mean let, because if I really were focused on playing defensively and actually blocking <laughs> and not just rushing around, they would never touch me. Forgot we don't have a lightning wand anymore. There we go, we got him. I'm sure we'll have a lightning wand again, but I mean, this one just does like a thousand damage, so. That's special there. Actually, let's do. Uh, is there something good up there? Can I knock that down? No. <gasps> Blue boy, please give me the potion. Oh yeah, I died, died, died by the acid. Please die by the acid. I want to do the quest. Hmm. Dang it! I mean, even my little baby, I was just trying to, to knock, do a little bit more damage of like, oh, he fell. <laughs> to have him dangling by a thread and then, then I was gonna, I, sh oh, I should have just knocked him back with my sack because it doesn't do as much damage. <sighs> Hello, boys. Secret. All right, well, you know, I'll backtrack for a secret. That's an exception. All right. Oh, here we go. Um, let's do perps first. Perps in blue. That is many things. Ooh, 524 armor, so it's m more armor, but there's no... The plus 33 dexterity, I think, makes it worth it to keep this, even though it's a bit less armor. And the level 2 Mastersmith, level 3 dexterity, and, and level of artisan. Yeah. Got a sword. Irradiated Crothac of the Monkey King. All right. Ooh, component 3,000 insidious hunk of parted seas. So our last one did 2,600 and change. Um, so this is another <laughs> like 400. Our old one had like a max of like 2,000. So in an episode, we're going up. A thousand damage and that's just the base damage um Wow so if we're doing 2000 20,000 max damage now with this weapon uh, like an extra 400 I have to imagine we're gonna be pushing with mod with the extra damage like I don't I don't even know man like cuz we're doing when crafted weapons do an extra 20% so like, yeah, it's going to be like 22, 23,000. I, I, I don't even know. Ooh, that's a, sh that shaft is actually, we'll hold on to that one. And this wand, let's check it. Lightning magic, it does more damage. It's got a level of master smith. Has the level of artisan. 
Strength is 17. Ah. 1175. 10-13. You know, this one does more damage and is lightning, which I like. But we'll keep the 17 strength for now. Yeah. Okay. Let's, uh... Exact these perps. We're keeping that shaft. This ring. Intelligence plus 24. You know, maybe it's time. This has Master Smith as well and Artisan. Yeah. We're swapping out the ring. Look at that. Our equipment level went up one as well. Losing a couple hundred damage. But I th that's crazy. The nine strength. Okay. Gloves. Nah. Nah, nah, nah. Ring. Do the blue. We've got a gem. No strength or anything. Uh, it's green though. We'll save it. Blue. Huh? Oh, is that a that was a cursed one? I think. So now it is blessed. Uh, I'll piercing. Okay. One of these days we'll give the piercing wands a, a fair shake. Or I'll try. Plus one. Uh, glow in the dark, chain of the boar. Plus three fifty eight max HP. Some skills, but no, no, no stat ups. Okay, we're all green. Now, now, let's see if we got a lot of green in here. Let's see if we get an enchantment or an elixir. <gasps> Dude, like, plus 30 strength. I, I think you're on to something. The, again, the individual or individuals, there's probably multiple people, but thank you for pointing that out. Because, yeah, you do, we just do get a lot more potions when we sacrifice green stuff. So that must increase our chance of getting one of these potions. Look at that. So 3,300 health and 19... 6... 60. So we went up by a thousand damage and uh, 200 HP. That's just that's just bonkers. And we got a, we got a lot of green here, so we may get another. Pog potion. It would be nice. You know, I'm not gonna be greedy. But it would be nice. Um Yeah, goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. We don't want to put non-greens on because uh our little God here will be angry with us. How dare you give me something less than green. Gosh. Just keep getting stuff. Jar of Quicksilver. That's the second one we've ever seen. The first one, I've never used it. And we've been holding on to it for many, 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 many floors and like new game pluses and stuff. It's actually kind of wild that we haven't seen a second one until now. I mean, 
invulnerability for 30 seconds is really good. We've been doing the boss, you know, the boss fight, like the boss fight, not the spider one, but the other one. And like, it doesn't even last 30 seconds <laughs> with how strong we are, but. Hey, man. What's the deal? He died somehow. Any big boxes? Mm. I mean, the altar is right there. So I guess I can bring back these guys. It's on the way as well. Gotta actually remember. Hey, okay, I'm. Yes, okay. <gasps> I mean, we sacked one blue and two greens. Plus 40 dexterity. This is just utterly insane. Just when you think we can't get any more potions, we do. I'm not even looking at these. I, I'd rather just get the pure stat ups. <laughs> Okay, this guy plus four strength, not bad, but Amulet, no. All right, compare that. We drink that. We get rid of that. Alrighty, let us get out of here and let us call it a wrap for the episode. We, I, I actually thought we were going to be able to get double digit floors done, but, you know, we, or get two double digit floors. We're on floor nine. We'll pick up speed, hopefully, um, and maybe, maybe, maybe kind of not worry about exploring every crevice. But I, here's my thing. I would love it if the game, I complained about this many times, but if you use the map, okay, it maybe it doesn't have to tell you where the hallways are, but I would love for the altar rooms to show up on the map. That's really what I want. Because if that were the case, I would go into a floor, I would use it. You know, if we knew we needed to, to we wanted to craft, you know, we'd, we'd craft that floor. Um, you know, we'd stop at the shops, get our free item, but if I knew there wasn't an altar on a floor, I'd be less likely to explore the whole floor. You know what I'm saying? I think I'd be okay with, with, with skipping a bit more. Anyways, let me know what you guys think. If you think it's okay to 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 not 100 percent explore everything i i just don't want to get too sloppy and and try to like um skip out on too much stuff because again it's less experience which means less level ups which means less perma learning and and less stats and all that stuff and we're going to be missing out on potential items here and there and blah 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 but i don't know. i'm also okay to keep just doing it how we're doing it Because, I mean, look at how strong we're getting. I'm excited. This is also plus 35 strength. On this bad boy, which I can't remember. How much strength does this have as a whole? Okay, 97, but a lot of that is from the gems. I can't remember how much strength was on the actual uh, mace head itself 
I don't think it was more than 35. I, what's, did, did they even have any? I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know, Margo. Anyways, uh, that's going to do it for this episode. Uh, I'm pogged. I'm ready for the next one. Uh, that's what I think. <laughs> I'm yawning so it may not seem like I'm pogged, but I am. I am. Um, and yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll just, we'll keep on keeping on. I'm excited because every time we play this, I'm like, all right, what, what else is there to see? We're kind of going through every, over and over. <clears throat> but I think there's going to be a lot more unique items to be had as well. But also, I'm pretty sure at this point, once we beat level 45, I'm just... I'm thinking the next dungeon is going to be the 70 floor dungeon. I think we just go, we just go for it. You know? I don't know. Anyways, uh, sorry. Uh, long outro. I love you. Thank you very much for the support. Um, if you like the episode, please give it a like if you're new around here and you enjoy it. Uh, and you want to see more, subscribe. I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, peace out.